a light heavyweight contest. A little bit of peaky blinders going on. That's it, we are in the black country, it'd be rude not to. Yes. Don't forget, mate, Peaky Blinders is Birmingham's finest. Well, don't forget, no, don't yeah, forget. Yeah. <laughs> well, enough of that. I feel like by the time the uh, the note maker got to the got to the second half of the show, they just couldn't be bothered to do any more notes. Yeah, that's you it. Know nothing about any of these voices. <laughs> Yeah, he's on the way out the door, mate. I do know, though, that Christian Bleacher is in tremendous shape. Yeah, and he can fight off as good as his abs look. And dream for a good fight. Yeah, it's interesting. I've seen some of the low-level fights. Just just get one, one on pure strength and, 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 and power alone. A lot of time that's all you need, you know, boxing basics, a bit of determination, straight punches, the one-two, double jab, early on in, in your career, they're, they're some of the only shots that you need, but of course, I don't know how many times either of these gentlemen have stepped foot into a boxing ring. Yeah, I'd say these could be veterans. Yeah, Christian Pichier looks, looks relaxed. Chris Marku. There's a, there's a Marku in the pro ranks. Uh, gets a lot of British people talking. Can Lewis Marku do the same? These absurd days. Yeah, they are. Uh, very jealous. Two weeks after my fight, my abs aren't there anymore. They will be for my next one, though. Yeah, that's, that's my excuse as well. <laughs> Old players coming out swinging for this final contest of the evening. Maybe we've saved the best till last. Or the most punches. Yeah. yeah who, who is going to have... This could just be a case of outlasting outlasting the, the other who has the, the physical strength and stamina and fitness to outlast the other but not only that who has the mental strength because this is really draining as well when you have to start fast and your opponent's throwing bombs really really difficult Man, the crowd are going wild here someone needs to take control of this they shouldn't be banging on the ring no. like this. Oh, well, a bit a bit too close. You know, like just swinging. I think it's with, with Christian though, he's, he's just looking at the floor, really. Swinging punches and hoping something lands. Lewis looks the, the best. A referee physically involved in this one as well. It's almost turning into a, a triple threat match. WWF style. Nice body shots going in there though from Pitcher, sinking them in. I think the referee needs to just kind of let him crack on with this one. Both lads are as untidy as the other, really. Yeah, it's a very wild fight. Marku just seemed to, to open up there and almost allow. Pitcher to, to hit him with some shots, which is a tactic I wouldn't recommend. Wow, I mean, he almost took a light off the ceiling <laughs> with that punch, I swear. Chandelier is shaking. Oh, I'm right out there, yeah, that stopped him in his tracks. But still fighting on, fighting through, gritting his teeth. And that's the end. Of round number one. We should have just had one really long round. 
a bit of a fight till someone quit. Seems, uh, well, some <laughs> wild swings, and I'll tell you what, when you're missing punches, there's nothing more energy zapping and swinging some big bombs and just hitting air, shadow boxing. So fatiguing. Christian Klitscher will be hoping, praying for a bit more of a punch accuracy success going into the second round. Yeah, he put a lot of effort into that round. Yeah. I'd, I'd like to see what he's gotten left. seconds, who knows? But a lot of support here for Marku. Just gets grazed with an overhand right. Yeah, it's seems, going in. Yeah, it seems like there's a lot of support for, for both guys here. The crowd are going wild. I tell you what, I, I bet he makes the right mess when he goes swimming. Then he's all that splashing about. Okay. Trying to work his free hand though, his, his supporters are fighting the fight for him outside the ring as well, they're, they're swinging away. That big some big right hands Yeah, there. this is just back and forth action. It's like table tennis stuff, back and forth, back and forth for both legs. Lewis Marku, Christian Pleacher, putting it all on the line for our final fight of the evening. It's been a great night though at the, at the venue. Black country, white colour boxing. Oh, and that, that's, he's gone, he's yeah. gone. Referee, well, the referee giving him a standing count. He's done for though. He's looking at the yeah. floor, his eyes are all over the place. He's just jumping in the ring, get out of the ring. Yeah. Yeah, they've got to stop, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I think this fight should be stopped myself. I'm not, I'm not too happy watching this continue. Yeah, the ref needs to take a closer look at this, I think. There's, there's less coming back from Pitcher now as well. He's been swinging for the fences for around and half, but now there's nothing coming back. Marku, for me, needs to go down to the body. Drum shield out. Yeah, I'm sure who he was. Pitcher's the thing. Oh, big uppercut there. Come on, ref. We need to step in here now, so. Yeah, fight's over. Crowd goes wild. You'd think he's won the world title. Man just breaks his glasses. Uh, there's a certain level right here. He hasn't become he hasn't become the WBC world champion or anything, you know. Let's let's put a bit of perspective on it. If you want to get in the ring so badly, sign up to the next show. Uh, last little bit of respect between the fighters. We're about to get the announcement for the last fight. Some really good national boxing contest. Please put your hands together for both of these boxers. Ladies and gentlemen, let us respect this contest with your winner in the red corner. Lewis for, for Lewis Marku on the him and his supporters are clearly very very happy about it and rightfully so he'll have a good weekend now he'll be up all night celebrating yeah, it's a great moment